If you want to make a circle transition to look something like this, start by adding a colour rectangle to your scene and resizing it to your likings. I'm also going to change the colour from white to black. Next, head into the inspector, go down to the materials tab and create a new shader material. Select this material and create a new shader. Now we need to code the shader that will give us the effect that we want. You can get the code by heading to this web page that is linked in the description and clicking this copy button here. The shader that we will be using was created by Bramwell Williams, so full credit goes to him. Once you've done that, head back to Godot and paste the code inside of the shader that we created. Your colour rectangle should now look like this. You can change the size of the circle by adjusting this slider. To make this into a circle transition effect, add an animation player node as a child of our colour rectangle node. Select the animation player node and create a new animation called open. Now select your colour rectangle node and set the circle size to 0. Once you've done that, add a keyframe. If this pops up, just click create. Move the animation along to one player, set the circle size to 1 and add another keyframe. If you now play your animation, it should look like this. Finally, create a new animation called close and repeat these steps. This time the original value should be 1 and the end value should be 0. If you now play it, it should look like this. Now all you have to do to get these effects is play this animation between switching scenes. And that's about it. Consider checking out this video on screen.